What if you want to build something but don't have any printed circuit board material? Or even matrix board? Well, head to the kitchen cupboard and you might have something suitable. Today I'll describe a simple audio oscillator built on a piece of crisp bread. Bit of a different smell to doing it with plastic. Here's the circuit I'm copying from a very simple two transistor audio oscillator. One transistor is NPN and the other PNP. I've put in the needed holes and started to mount the components. You can just see a resistor in the top left. Just applied power and it worked first time. If I wanted to make the ticking more frequent to give a continuous tone then I'd adjust either the resistor or capacitor values. I've just got here a 3.9k resistor. I'll just put it in parallel with a 33k Now the thing I could do is to substitute the electrolytic capacitor instead of 33 microfarads I might go for something less like say 4.7, 2.2 or 1. A higher frequency with a smaller capacitor. Now I'll try the resistor trick again. If you want to build the tone oscillator from scratch and not the metronome, then use these values. So there it is, a simple way of assembling transistor circuits. With a circuit board you can find in your kitchen cupboard. Just don't eat it.